this year is online learning until further notice. I miss school, I miss my friends, uh, I miss seeing people as often as I usually do. It's been five months since we've been in school and it's already a new school year. I'm a senior this year. Um, it's kind of weird to say that I am because I still see myself as a junior or a sophomore. And I don't know, it's just this year is definitely different obviously because we're doing remote learning and no one's really done that before so it's all new to everyone. And at first I was sad that that's how I was starting my senior year but I mean it is what it is, it's what we have to deal with. So I'm okay with it. I honestly didn't really care about it as long as I still have my senior year second semester because you know I want to experience you know prom and I don't know what other senior activities there are and graduation and whatnot so hopefully that happens um, I mean we could only think of the positives about this and you know everyone is going through it so we just have to deal with it I guess um, Remote learning has been, I want to say difficult, but not difficult in a way of school being hard. I mean difficult in um, paying attention because I am finding it so hard to pay attention to when my teachers are speaking on Zoom because <laughs> I have a lot of distractions at home or not that anyone's distracting, but like my phone is distracting, um, my dog in the background is distracting, sometimes my sister's home, so she is distracting, and I know she tries her best to stay out of my way, but I know it happens, and I'm grateful that I, <laughs> this might sound bad, but that I don't have a younger sibling to take care of, because I know there's kids that do, and they have to take care of them, make sure they're doing school, so it's, it's a little, it's hard. And I know I don't have it as bad, but my attention span is just not focused on school when I need to. So, I mean, I've been doing better, but I really wish I was in school so I could actually get my work done instead of waiting to the last minute to do work. And how do I feel about this? Um, staying home, doing the work, it's, it's all right. I'm still getting used to it. Uh, it's just weird waking up and going straight to my computer and doing it. School, online school. Kind of hate it. It's stressful. Online school is not for me. Seriously, like I feel I could do better when I'm in actual school, not online school. As you can see, we are in my room, and those are all my pop fingers. I am in my room because we are distance learning for. I, who knows how long, um, but this is due to the coronavirus, um, so hopefully we can go in to in-person learning soon, because I prefer it, because I can, like, interact with people, I can talk, like, I don't, it's, yes, you can, you can do that on a Zoom call, but it's just, it's awkward. Like, it's, it's different. It's really different, and I, I'm not a big fan of it. Maybe after a little longer, I'll like it a little more. But as of right now, I do not like it. Um, or AC went out, like, a week ago. And we got it fixed. We got it fixed. We're good. But oh, it... It was hard to focus on school because it was so hot, especially with Arizona weather. It was, it was not, not good. It's pretty, it's, it's hard because like I'm isolated in my bedroom alone doing school. Like, it's, it's not, it's not fun. Like, I mean, yeah, if you're laughing with, like, classmates, if you know people, you can, like, make a joke or whatever, and, like, you, it's, it, it can be fun, 
but then like you're kind of just sitting there like okay what do I do what do we do now like um but all my teachers are super supportive and really nice I like just they're they're like okay with like if you need extra time okay they they'll give you extra time but if you didn't use your time wisely, then probably not, which is which is normal for like in-person distance learning, all of it. Um, but it's, I don't know. I don't have a full opinion on it yet. Um, online school, to be honest, hasn't been too complicated. It's been all right. Um, the only problems I really do have sometimes is when I don't complete my work and then I just have to do it later on that day because I have to complete it either way. Um, otherwise, life has just been pretty simple, not too bad. I guess I'll just talk about how this uh, corona and stuff has affected my senior year. Um, I am a senior, um, so after this I go into college. It's scary to think about college in a way. Um, I mean, time flew, and I'm already at the point where I'm gonna be an adult and um, take care of myself. So, ah, a part of me is like really excited. I'm really excited to see what my future holds. Um, I don't know. I just kind of excited, you know. Uh, but yeah. So as you know, we've been doing virtual learning. Um, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. I really thought it was going to be like super bad. Like, but it's honestly it's pretty cool. Like we have. Um, it's not like I don't know. There's some people who have their own opinions about it. But I think mine it's fine. Other than um, there is a lot of work that has been given to us, um, which I mean it makes sense as my last year but I'm just trying to balance me this is me every day during school my at home I got my little dog Daisy right there She's asleep all the time though but I don't mind her company a bit math is a bit hard for me mostly because I'm bad with numbers history I like because film and history and also theater I like those classes a lot, honestly, because they're mostly creative, and history, I'm more of a history buff. Yeah. And I don't really know what I'm supposed to be talking about during this, so I'm gonna just talk about the online school stuff. And personally, I don't mind it, because I get it, but I also don't like it, because I would rather just have in school so that I'm able to meet people, and then also so that I'm able to kind of meet my teachers because even though the teachers are like talking to us all the time and trying to make us feel welcome and like feel more used to what's going on they aren't really like it's not really like one-on-one -on -one. like it's just general talking to the teachers and then also with meeting people like you can't really meet people because you're not able to like, talk to anyone else but your teacher if you have a question or anything since we're supposed to stay on mute and even in the breakout rooms it's like awkward because Everyone will just be quiet, and then someone randomly will just be like, so what you guys, like, it's not like actual talking, it's just talking about school, which is what you're supposed to do in school, but everyone knows, like, people talk other than school. It has been super hard for me, because a lot of the work is more, like, time consuming, since they give us more work in online than they would at regular school, but it's not that difficult if I keep myself on track with all my work. And I feel like school is easier, but it's more like stressful for like yourself and your self-esteem, but it's still kind of really hard online. And let's see, I'll talk about distance learning, I guess. So we started three weeks ago, I think. 
I don't like it. I mean, I kind of like it, but I also don't really like it at all. Because it's a lot of work. I feel like it's more work than actual class. Like today was actually an interesting day because I started off my day math. Math with a little field. And I am just so slow at math, so <laughs> I did not have a good time. So, you know, crying. <laughs> um, and then it's the rest of my day was pretty okay. I was still stressed. But so, distance learning, definitely new, definitely interesting. So what I wanted to talk about was um, how like distance learning has been affecting me and how like the whole like virus and not being able to do certain things is affecting me. And for the most part, like it's fine. Like I don't mind being at home, but it was really a bad time because of like how I like I'm going to college next year and I have to figure out all like the paperwork and stuff. And to me personally, I'd rather like go in person to request like transcripts and stuff and like just talk to people about it instead of having to do everything via like email and like having to keep track of who I'm emailing and who like I'm talking to instead of actually talking like person to person. And I feel like learning is a bit, it's fine for me. It's not like hard learning over like the internet and stuff. But like others might not relate to that, which I like I completely understand because it can be hard. And um something else I want to talk about. Just like yeah, it's just college, like I don't I'm afraid that like this virus and like quarantine's gonna go in like beyond just this year and it'll go into 2021 and I'm afraid that might affect me going into like college because I don't wanna have to do college online just because I want to actually get that experience like in person and just that like things have been like weird but other than that everything's like fine I'm just here chilling at home school it's awesome I really like how it's self-paced most of the time I like how classroom like Google classroom is structured in some classes you have to go into zoom every single day but that's okay. Film is really fun because I, I don't know. There's something about it. There's something about having the teacher mute everybody just like on purpose because we're being too like loud. Something about it is great. Theater is really fun. I somehow managed to convince Pankrats to play Jackbox games and that was really fun. We played a few games of Quip. We played a game of Quiplash, and it was pretty. It was pretty awesome. And I think we're gonna do it again today. Hello. I know my hair is messy, but I wanted to shout out the teachers because I know they're working hard to put school together online, especially since they'll rather have us in person. But unfortunately, we cannot. And I'm really thankful that they're working the hardest. Hi, Miss Kim. Hi, Mrs. Hi, Mr. Golden, and. Hi, Miss Shu, and to all my teachers I have this year, I hope you guys are doing well and hope to see you when we get back. Dear Flowing Ghost High School teachers, my name is Alexa Ramirez and I'm a sophomore. I'm new at the school and because of Corona, I haven't been able to introduce myself to my new teachers. I really hope that you're all staying safe and being healthy. I consider this video an opportunity to introduce myself to my teachers and probably make new friends. We should all be ready for coming back to school because we're going to make it together. Everything is pretty different since now classes are through Zoom meetings. But that should not be an excuse for us to keep on with our good grades. I know this is hard for all of us, but I really hope that this video helped a bit on introducing myself and knowing more about me. So yeah, thank you and have a nice week.